can pace through multiple gauge layouts using the weather resistant tactile side buttons that work even with racing gloves on. No matter the use. Going 200 miles an hour down through the top, man. That's just absolutely nuts. One of them's going to hit you or they're going to crash trying to avoid you. It's just dumb. Don't be dumb. Come on, Sparky. Don't be dumb. Jeff Mueller, the 06 Mitsubishi Evolution, number 30 qualifier with a 910. Todd Haddock in the TCI is literally number 33. He is outside looking in. He went 931 with a 5. He's got to go quicker than a 930 to get back up into the field. Probably trying to get into the 8 seconds.
going to go on a Saturday afternoon cruise down. I'm not going to risk it. Kicking up toe. I'm not going to risk it. Anyway, going for that 36 mile. We're going to try uh, well, neutral work. See if first gear works. <laughs> Tip number two here. Maybe. So Julia Bello having issues getting the car refired out. Alright, so it looks like he's just gonna take the beam. Alright, you know what? Probably a smart decision just take the beams at this point. Bovine section of five and six. Here we go with Real Street Super Street. First pair out, John A. Slip and Darren Barone. Numbers three and four qualifies. We separate by 18 thousandths of a second. Let's go! And the Let's Go Brandon car on the left side of the racetrack. All right, everybody with me now. Let's go, Brandon. Yeah. God bless America. I wonder if that Chevrolet Camaro came with a mullet. Severed married for John Haleslip. Or 22 cubic inches under the hood. Charlie, your number four qualifier, Darren Barone. Green Law, New York, the 1980 Mustang is currently number three in qualifying. Everybody's trying to get inside of the 769 to go number one. You see the 920 on the scoreboard. That is the bump spot to make a quick 32 field here in Real Street, Super Street. Let's go Brandon Carr, the first one up, right? He won the race to the lane. Yeah. Nice. Why not be your board? He's the real winner. Yeah. No, no 3 a.m. late night right now. Sometimes it's a uh, little tricky and sticky, but once you get it moving, the car makes plenty of power. So let's see if we get to the one. Charlie Barnes, JPC Racing on board, a Coyote Motor, single turbo, Eric Holiday tuning it up. The Maryland boys are in the house. They were the first ones to run seven, slightly ahead of the guy who went into the seven faster, but they went seven faster, or first. So the first seven seconds run of the weekend here in Real Street, Super Street. They're currently number six for the 799. I told Eric, go get a bigger hammer, hit it harder. They were trying to sneak into the sevens without blowing the doors off the sevens. Five or six other guys did, so Eric said, well, now's our turn. So let's see if they got it whipped up. And let's see if Waleed can get out of that bottom half of the field to jump into the top 16 in qualifying. They're both in the field pretty safe at the moment. Florida, the K-Series powered machine FL2K. 
on the door, of course. FL2K is home at Bradenton Motorsports Park. We love Victor being up here racing with us. Don't forget Snowbird. Then through the 7th of December, $15,000 to win Pro Modified Race. Got the absolute greatest Pro Mods in the world to be down there for that big race. You'll be able to see it live on flowracing.com. Currently number 19 in the field, trying to move up. Make your left side, Joe Flick, your right side.
All right, so again, Rios here in the right-hand lane, just trying to get inside of that 867 to get into the field. Wow. 74 out the back. What a best pass. 